When I think of the lab, I think of enterprising, creativity, catalytic, groundbreaking, connection, collaboration. It's a hub for crazy geniuses. Profound. Opportunity. International. Euphoria. Risk taking. The Lab Cambridge is a unique contemporary art and design center dedicated to cultural experimentation at frontiers of science. It will open in 2014 as a partner to Les Laboratoires, which is the Lab Paris. The Lab Cambridge is an outcome of the Lab at Harvard University, a three-year innovation learning project and idea exhibition space. For me, the lab is about creativity, innovation, and an amazing experience with students of different schools. For me, the lab is um, maybe the new way of life. Art and design exhibitions each year will highlight original work by leading international artists and designers in collaboration with scientists from the Boston and Cambridge areas and around the world. Designed by French designer Mathieu Lehigneur, working with architectural firm Brown Fenolosa Architects, the Lab Cambridge will bring to New England a rare insight into innovations that are shaping the world. It's a very exciting experience for me to see young people have an opportunity to explore, to dream, and to link into their creative side. All the ideas are so creative and we're so excited to be here. The Lab Cambridge will be home as well to educational experiments involving students at Harvard University and in the Boston Public Schools as the International Center of Harvard Professor David Edwards' innovation education work in the School of Engineering and Applied Sciences and the International Art Science Prize. The Eisenhower Prize is for me a great experience and an innovation project uh, to try to, to change a, a little bit the world. Art science, even the concept, the word art science reminds me of uh, one of our major divisions at the Walt Disney Company, which is Imagineering. When we put together imagination and engineering, and art science has successfully put together art, design, with engineering. Experimentation in the lab will occasionally lead to innovations, and these will sell in the commercial store of the lab, the Lab Store. Here visitors will discover breakthrough designs emerging from the Lab Cambridge, as well as innovations from other labs in the Cambridge area. These will include the latest creations from the Lab Paris, such as plants that filter the air, furniture that breathes, foods with packaging that we eat, or that arrive in our mouths through the air. The lab for me is a place for friendship, love, and intelligence. Well, that's the definition of design. You are in a place that is almost unique in the world, because it's a place of exploration, scientific and artistic at the same The lab is coming to Cambridge. Developed by David Edwards' creative organization, Art Science Labs, the lab will be guided by local art, science and technology leaders from Harvard University, the Cloud Foundation, and the Boston Art Science Prize, and the technology community, including Polaris Venture Partners and Flagship Ventures. The lab is boundless because there's no boundaries between disciplines and there's no limit to what you can do. People say the world has become a lab. Here in Cambridge, it has long felt that way. The lab, even more than a window into who we can become, might actually be better imagined as a reflection of who we are.